I I cut my finger last week at work. It was like a little bit cut up there, but it's it hurting a bit more today. What's up guys, how are you guys doing today? So today guys, don't forget to be different, have some fun, and be yourself guys, but the past week during a school and when I wasn't recording, it snowed, so there's a bit of snow, but I like record. it, I guess it snowed on Wednesday night, when, yeah, like late Wednesday night, early Thursday morning, but um, I... I cut my finger last week at work and I luckily I didn't need stitches. It wasn't a knife, it was just like a sauce cup. It cracked in half, but it did cut my finger a decent amount. It's not fun, but anyway, I do I recorded a little bit of video from that last week, so I'm gonna put that in right now. So this is what happened to my finger, like it's cut there. But I ended up not needing stitches and it was like a little bit cut up there. But it's it hurting a bit more today. But anyway, I don't know, back to the video. And it has now healed. I know it wasn't the greatest and I didn't realize that how bad it was. But it has healed since and um I don't know, it's not like it's getting dark outside and it's only Look, it's only like 2.16 right now, and so, I don't know, it's not good that it's getting this dark already. But anyway, this is a little update of, on my finger, and my camera's about to die. So, that's just a little bit of an update. I'm about to go downstairs, have some lunch, even though it's 2.16, and then I'll catch you guys later. It is now later, it's currently 4.07, and I'm about to head to work right now. My shift is at 4.30 till closing, which is 10.30, so six hour shift, but I do get dinner at around like 7.30, cause that's like three hours break, then like another three hours, so it should be good tonight. Um, yeah, so I'll see you guys later. So, I just got back from work right now. It is currently 10.50 and it was a pretty good shift. I got, I just got the regular quarter dinner, but I ended up cutting myself again. Just now I have, you know, the situation. It was just like a little jab with a knife, but uh, it was kind of, it looked like a paper cut, so not a big deal. And now I've become a joke at work pretty much. Like everything I pick up, they say, don't cut yourself, but I don't know. I just pretty much just become a joke, but the Penguins won in a shootout uh, is what I saw. And uh, if I can find this, um, it says, yeah, so uh, Pittsburgh won in a shootout. It, let's see, so we have, let's go, Chicago scored twice. Um, let me just go to the NHL app, and apparently Crosby got injured, so, uh, Crosby injured in Penguin shootout win against Blackhawks, so Murray, Murray saves sh win, Murray save win shootout, and, uh, apparently, Crosby sustained an apparent injury in the third period of a 3-2 shootout win. And uh, he did not return after blocking a shot from Eric Gustafson, you bugger, at 134 of the third. 
and uh, no update was provided. But um, so Pittsburgh won three to two, and uh, Colorado is winning right now, and St. Louis is winning right now. There's nothing in the San Jose Nashville game. The Islanders ended up beating the Panthers two to one. Tampa ended up beating Buffalo um, five to three. There, Buffalo had 43 shots to 40 shots. Let's just see the Pittsburgh and Chicago game was really tight. It was uh, 31 to 31 shots, and um, and then let's just go. Philly ended up beating Toronto in a shootout three to two. Montreal beat LA three to two, and. Um, Ottawa beat Carolina four to one. Vegas lost to Washington five to two, and Minnesota beat Arizona four to three. And then tomorrow, uh, I don't think the Penguins play tomorrow, but the Leafs play again against the Blackhawks. But let's just see the Pittsburgh game. So, um, so I don't know. Some guy scored on Chicago first. Then Patrick Kane, Gensel scored, Rust scored, Rust is on fire. Uh, and then, uh, oh, in the shootout, Gensel scored. Taze, uh, Murray saved on Taze. Um, Malkin, uh, he didn't score. Kane scored, Jared McCann scored, and Alex DeBrinket didn't score. So Pittsburgh ended up beating Chicago. 3-2, to two, and there were 33 shots each. Chicago had a better face-off percentage, and Chicago had two power plays. Pittsburgh got three. Chicago had six penalty minutes. Pittsburgh had four. Chicago had 35 hits, almost 10 more than Pittsburgh with 26. Pittsburgh had more blocks by two. Pittsburgh had 14. Chicago had uh, 12. Pittsburgh had more giveaways with 11 to 7, and Pittsburgh had more takeaways with 10 to 4. So, it seems like it was a good game. I wish I got to see it, and Ole Mata, I guess, returned home for the first time in a while, So, uh, which is kind of crazy. But um, anyway, I'm about to go downstairs and I guess just relax for a little bit, even though it's 1055, so I'll catch you guys later. I just got back upstairs right now. It is currently 12.08 and my fingers are getting better. I just hope tomorrow I don't cut anything. But honestly, I might have jinxed myself. But I have my heater on right now just because it is, it is kind of cold. And I have these Christmas lights up here, but like I'm not gonna turn them on yet just because Remembrance Day hasn't passed. So I will turn them off or turn them on like the day after Remembrance Day just or a couple days after just to because like to be respectful of like our veterans and I don't know I don't think personally I don't think we should um, like do anything Christmas related before Remembrance Day just because people just get carried away and it like I don't know t personally I don't think Remembrance Day means a lot to people anymore, but I do take Remembrance Day seriously. I just, I think we should care about our veterans, and I don't know, one day doesn't really seem enough, but if it only is one day, I think that we should really, really care about it. But anyway, enough of that. It is getting later, and I do have a shift tomorrow, and I'm I don't know, I'm kind of tired, my legs are really tired somehow, I don't know why. But I do believe that is going to have to end off today's video, so I would basically like to thank you guys so much for watching, and I do hope you guys enjoyed. And if you like to watch another video, guys, 
be subscribed to my YouTube channel, turn on my post notifications, and smash that like button. Smash. See how much Peace out. I will see you guys in tomorrow's video.